Runway LF is a state-of-the-art in-context video model which is setting a new frontier for multitask visual generation with the ability to perform a wide range of edits on an input video. And this includes things like adding, removing and transforming objects. At the same time, you can generate any angle of scenes depending on what you're trying to create and modify the style, the lighting and several stuff on the video that you're making. And this is just amazing. Now the folks at Runway have created a couple of things before and one of the cool ones that they've just recently announced is the Runway Act 2. Now Runway Act 2 is an interesting way of capturing motions from a real life character and transferring that motion to a generated model or a 2D image. And of course the examples that they also put together is pretty nice. And this is something they announced a couple of days back. And seeing Runway LF follow shortly just means that the folks at Runway are looking at putting tools in the hands of creators for them to be able to make stuff. Runway LF is targeted to those that are into filmmaking, composition and a good level of VFX as there is a couple of cool examples that are right here that you can go ahead and explore. One of them you can see right here has to do with camera generation. So you can generate new camera angles from a footage that you've taken before. Say for example you take your normal footage and you would like to generate an angle that is totally different from what you've got here, you can do all of that from a wide shot all the way to an extreme close up and down to a medium shot. So this would take into account all of the features that it has from the original one and reconstruct the footage to sort of match what you've got with the original video as well. There's also some interesting ones that has to do with generating the next shot. So in this case, you can create seamless continuations of your story and you can see all of that with this example here from shot one to shot two and shot three. And there's also the use of style transfer as you can now transform any video with your desired aesthetic. And this is also going to pull through with that. So we can transfer the styles however we want and get something pretty nice. You can also do this particular one, which I think a lot of people would work with. So if you're into VFX, maybe you're into, you know, composition, you can take a simple video or you can simply shoot at any point in time. And when you shoot no longer matters because you can literally do anything. You can change the environment, you can change the location, you can change the seasons, and you can also change the time of day. At the same time, you can also change the style and change literally everything. So your performance is key. Angle is no longer key so much because at this point you can literally go ahead and change it. What matters now is the storytelling and Runway Aleph seems to hinge on that as it provides visual tools that you can use to create stunning stuff. So in case you'd like to add rain to your scene, maybe sandstorm, freeze, city stuff, maybe you just like to change the total environment of your scene, you can now do all of that. Now you can add stuff to your scene. In this case, we can see the original video. We can see fireworks, palm trees, Characters can be added and also crowd. So this stuff takes some time. So you either have to, you know, track your shots and then unload in the crowd and possibly blend them, make sure that the lighting is working perfectly. In this case, with this, you can now add crowds easily. At the same time, if you're thinking of removing stuff from your scene, you can, of course, go ahead and do that. Like here, you can see there is the removal of smoke, removal of person, which is really good. So you can have a clean plate. Reflection removal, which is also really good. You can also see that we've got a bit more of a clean plate here. And we've also got the removal of reflections as well, which is also really good in case you want to make that very impossible shot that we get to see in most VFX videos. And if you're thinking about changing object, possibly you like to transform the object into something else, you can do all of this. So Runway Aleph seems to be the compositing and VFX tool that the folks at Runway are currently working on. There's also this very good example that exists here where you can add characters and possibly just change the character how you want. And if you've seen Martin Scorsese's Irishman, you possibly can tell that stuff like this take a lot of time and a lot of effort to do. But with tools like this, this might eventually make them pretty easy to create. So we can see from old to young, adult to child, young man to old man as well. Recoloring elements seems to be something that will also be possible. And we've also got relighting your shots. And like we mentioned earlier, as much as lighting is important, some of these things can now be changed. So in terms of relighting shots, you can now do all of that. 
And if you're thinking about keying out a character, this is now super clean and so you can easily go ahead and do that and throw them into different backgrounds. So lots of things from the folks at Runway at this point with Runway Aleph and it is looking pretty cool. Now we already mentioned that the folks at Runway are in partnership with the folks at Lionsgate and with all of this technology that is out, it's not going to be news if we get to see a ton of VFX stuff being done with Runway Aleph for upcoming feature films. So this is it for those who like to take a look at this or possibly for those who like to take a look at Act 2, maybe you want to start transforming your real life performance into digital performances with characters that you generated or created, then you can also come through and check this out. And if you like to try it, there is a waiting list that you can go ahead and join via the early access and you will be informed once this is available. Unfortunately, that is not the same with Runway Aleph as this has just been announced and is set to be coming soon. So this is it for those who like to take a look at this, possibly you'd like to see these things for yourself. Links to all of this is going to be in the description, so do well to check them out. And I'd like to see you guys in the next one. Peace.